keep cooking for our lemon brunch. We're going to do now a very simple uh, dessert and I want to share with you the recipe because it is, it is simple to make and it's simple to serve. And they are mini parfaits. I found these liter cups, I think they're shots, actually short the glasses uh, in Dollar, Dollar Tree, I think, and maybe six for a dollar. And I love them because they are just the right amount for a brunch, a brunch dessert. Okay, what we're gonna do, again, we're gonna do a lemon parfait and we're gonna utilize lemon cookies of course uh, we're gonna use lemon curd we're gonna use wet muesli i think that's how it's called it's like a cereal a cereal mix we're gonna utilize um almonds cream and strawberries and the first thing we're gonna do we're going to take the sandwich the sandwich cookies, we're gonna split it in half and we're gonna take pretty much all the cream out, but you, if you want, you can leave a little bit like this, okay? Don't take it all, all out because we still want to have a little bit of extra lemon flavor. And <clears throat> what you do, you take your sandwich cookies that are in half already, put it in a bag. You seal it very well, take the air out, seal it well, and we're gonna smash them. A rough smash, okay? We don't wanna, we don't wanna smash them completely. You just want a rough smash. And that's a rough smash right there. Okay. And we put it back in our cup, on our dish, I'm sorry. And what I mean with a rush smash is that you still have little pieces, you have little pieces but you also have big pieces of the cookie, okay? You still have big pieces of the cookie. All right, so what we're going to do, we're gonna take the lemon curd and, <clears throat> sorry, I forgot the spoon. <laughs> okay, we're gonna take some of this curd and if you haven't tasted lemon curd, let me tell you, this is really the, the the taste is really intense. It's really candy. So you want to, you need to other, you need to incorporate other ingredients or other flavors in order to balance it up a little bit. Okay. What we're going to do, we're gonna take, we're gonna take some of that curd. We're gonna help ourselves with this spoon which is tiny and we needed it. You're gonna put some of that at the bottom. Okay. Maybe it's not, gonna, not looking pretty now, but the flavor is what it counts. Now you want to put some of these lemon cookies. And we're layering, that's what we're doing. We're layering flavors and we're layering textures, okay? Good. We're gonna add some of these strawberries, because strawberries are so tangy and they're so good with any type of dessert. I really like strawberries, okay? You, if you want to add more curd on top of that, If you want a little crunch, then you add, I'm sorry, you add the muesli, the, the cereal. You add the cereal. 
I mean, uh, these are tiny spoons, okay? These are tiny, tiny spoons. Spoonfuls. You add a little bit of the almond. Press it down. Okay. And now, we're going to top it off with some cream. And maybe you want to put a little tiny piece of strawberry on top. Oh, look at how beautiful. You have perfect uh, layering of the lemon curve. You have the the cookie, you have the strawberries, you have the cereal, you have the almonds, and you have the cream and the strawberry on top. And this is just a winner dessert. And it's not that bad actually, because you I mean, you have cereal, you have almonds, and you know, the lemon curd is a little high in calories, but hey, Okay, let me see if I can get a little bit of everything. In my and now I want to taste a little bit of my parfait. And it has so many layers and I want a little bit of everything in my little tiny spoon. Let's see. Mm. I don't know if you can see, but we have lemon curd, we have cookie, we have strawberry, we have almonds. And it's really delicious. And how, I mean, you know, that is such a simple dessert. And it looks beautiful and it tastes wonderful. So, I hope you enjoy all the recipes that we did. And also, um, hopefully, let me know down below if you, which one was your favorite. And also try to subscribe to my channel and um, I'm just one, I'm very happy that I'm sharing these, all these tips and recipes with you. Everything in Alma's kitchen is homemade, but only it's not homemade, it's made with love. So I'm sending you love and peace. Bye-bye.